Hi, this is Message Bunny from YouTube, and today we are going to show you how to make these DIY hay racks. And this is what this is what they look um, after you're finished. And yeah, so this is what you'll need. Okay, first and most important, you'll need this thing. Um, we got it at Walmart for like I don't know for a few dollars, like ten dollars. And what it is, it's like a bathroom rack, I guess. Like, you can put, like, your shampoo and stuff in there. But we decided to make a pretty good hay rack. And we had a problem with them earlier because our rabbits kept jumping inside of them and making a big mess. And so we kind of decided to copy a hay rack we got from the HRS. And so this is what you need to make it. Obviously, you need this. You need a few binder clips, depending on how many, like, you want to put on there, how secure you want it to be some scissors, a hole punch, some rabbit safe string, a marker, and an old cereal box. Okay, so what you want to do is you you pick the side you want to start on and you should cut off your flap just cuz that would be annoying and then get in your way. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to take your rack and you want to flip these little handle things out. And then just put it over the top of this. Take your marker. And trace it. I would use a Sharpie, but I can't find one. And you might want to be careful because this can smear. So what you want to do is you want to cut all the way around it like this, and then take your hay rack and place it on top of it, and it should fit like this. So you'll want to put the holes on the side that your rabbits will pull the hay out, and in this case they're pulling them out of the front. So you'll want to put the holes right here, so when you open it up, the flap will go like this, and the bunnies can't push it open with their head. So, put it like so. Take your marker, and just grab it, and make a little dot where the hole should be. Do the same over here. So take your hole puncher and just put it over the little brown dot, or whatever color it is, and just make a little hole like that. Do the same on the other side. So here you should have two little holes on each corner. Okay, so now what you want to do is you want to take your string and a string or zip tie, you can use whatever you want. We just chose string because we didn't have any zip ties. So either one works. Um, just take your string and put it through the hole. Get the string about even length the top. Like this. And just, I tie it, like, I don't actually do a bow. I will actually tie it like four times, I guess just it's just more it's just better if you have it more secure and you want to make sure that you do cut off the extra string if you have any which you should so just cut it about here don't cut it too short or it might come undone like that and now you want to take your binder clips. I am personally only using two, just because they're a little bit difficult to get on and on, but you know, it's secure so your bunnies can't get it off. If you guys and have any better ideas, please comment them below. This is what we could think of for now. It's, yeah, it's just what we're doing. <laughs> and so, yeah, just kind of clip them on. Like, 
this, see what I mean? And go like that, and do the same for the other side. So yeah, this is what it should look like at the end. Comment, rate, subscribe, and thank you for watching.